Hey there guys, welcome to the next tutorial here on the channel. Welcome to Back to School Week. I'm going to be posting a whole bunch of tutorials uh, th this week as well as the next half of next week to um, kind of just give you guys a whole bunch of cool things that you can make and use in your school for when you guys go back to school pretty soon. So in this video I'm going to show you guys how to make kind of a locker organizer, something that you can hang on inside your locker, probably on the on the locker door as you open it up and kind of organize a whole bunch of things that you can that you can throw into this organizer here. Right, so really the only two things you're going to need are duct tape, I'm going to be using the beige and the brown duct tape in this video, as well as some magnets. Now if you're trying to attach this locker organizer to anything besides metal, I'm going to give you a few other you know, ways that you can attach it, but I'm assuming that your locker is probably made out of metal and that of course the magnets will stick to it without any trouble. So you're going to need probably, I would say four of these, I've got a little more than that here. I'll show you how to attach these once we get you know, to that part of the video. But if you don't have a, a metal locker or you're trying to attach it to something different, I'll also be giving you a few optional ways of kind of you know, attaching to the locker as well. So let's get started here. So your very first step is to really understand how wide the locker door is that you're using. Now I'm going to assume that it's about 8 inches long here. If you're using the same lockers as you have you know, in the previous years at your school or if they're all the same size, then you probably already have a general idea of how big they are. But if, if it, it helps, you know, just take a measuring tape your first day of school, you know, measure it, and then of course you can go home and make uh, whatever size you need to, uh, to make something here. So I'm going to do is assume that it's 8 inches here. I'm going to take 4 strips of tape. I'm also going to be taking a few more strips after this, but I'm just going to get you guys started. So I'm going to stick those two together, take my third piece here, and we're going to start overlapping these on top of each other so that we have a sheet of tape that will be roughly, I guess, about eight inches high. So this will be about four inches, a little, a little close to four inches. We're going to actually take four more strips and kind of double this, this uh, sheet here, make it eight inches high. All right, so that's what my sheet looks like. It's about eight inches high, it's double-sided, no sticky sides showing at all. So now this comes the point where you kind of have to decide exactly what you want to put into this organizer. Um, a lot of the things that you are typically, you know, keep in your locker, stuff that you want it to be, you know, like really accessible, you should try to throw into this locker organizer because as soon as you open your locker, it'll be there right on the door and you can grab it pretty quickly if you're trying to run to a class or something like that. So some of those things, you know, might be highlighters, pens, um, erasers, maybe you know, an extra school ID, you know, just a whole bunch of other cool things I'm going to kind of show you guys how to incorporate into this organizer here. So let's kind of focus on applying pockets and loops and whatever I'm trying to work into this organizer. Okay, so pens, pencils, those are the first things we're going to worry about. They're probably the most common thing that you use, you know, in school and in college. So I'm actually going to be working on how to attach those to the organizer first. All I did was cut out a strip of tape that's four inches long. And I have another strip of tape that's about two and a half inches long, maybe close to two inches. We're going to flip them both up top just like this, sticky side up. We're going to take our smaller piece and I'm going to attach that directly into the middle of the larger piece so that I have two parts of sticky side on each end of the smaller one. Then what I'm simply going to do is kind of just kind of puff it up in the center a little bit so it's kind of like a loop and you can definitely you know stick your finger underneath it and you want to very carefully just apply this to the part of the organizer. And you can kind of just arrange it to make it look nice and pretty. So make sure that the sticky part itself is totally stuck down then what we're going to do is simply take our pens and if they have you know a little like a little clip on it it's they're just going to clip right onto that piece there. If you're working on you know mechanical pencils they generally have you know a clip like this as well so you can kind of slide that those in right with those uh, the other pens. Uh, sometimes if you're using just you know a whole bunch of number two pencils just make a little pocket on the inside here so you can slip those in and the bottoms will sit in the pocket so it won't slide right out and you know fall on the ground. So that's our work on you know sticking pens into the organizer. Now taking a look outside of your traditional school supplies, like all the traditional things that you typically use at school, you could also look into you know working cosmetics into this as well. So one of the cool things that you might want to put into your uh, lock locker organizer is a mirror. Now I don't happen to have a mirror with me. I'm just going to pretend that this silver tape you know is a mirror here. Uh, you can get you know these simple square mirrors at your local craft store. I typically see them a lot at Joanne's Fabrics. That's kind of the one store in my area that carries a whole bunch of different mirrors, like small ones, round ones. You can just pick one of those up and say you wanted to stick that you know into your organizer 
mirror always comes in handy for a lot of cool reasons. You can just, you know, put that, lay that on top of your uh, organizer here, take a few strips of duct tape, it's not going to take very much, and then just simply stick the mirror into your locker organizer. Like I said, I wish I had one so I could show you exactly how it works, but you just take a few strips of tape, and as long as it's sealed in and it's not a very heavy mirror, you'll be able to use just a few strips of tape to apply it and make sure that it stays in there. It can really come in handy. Some of the other things that you can look at are, you know, just the supplies or items that you use on, like, on a typical daily basis. Like, I'm not sure if anybody uses, like, these kind of things anymore, like, for, like, breath mints or anything like that. But if you have, like, Altoids, if you use that, if your uh, school allows you to use gum, you can stick a pack into your locker organizer. A uh, lip balm is also a great um, idea. I'm going to kind of show you guys how to uh, make something for that right now because sometimes, you know, when stuff is kind of a circular object, it's a lot harder to attach into something like this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a strip of tape here that's about four Four inches long, maybe about four and a half inches. I cut out two small squares out of it, as you can see here and here. And then what I'm going to do is kind of use this as a wrap to stick something like this inside the uh, the organizer here. This is a lip balm, by the way. This is kind of a special brand that uh, you can use. I think they're called eggs, so they're kind of cool. So I got one piece here. When, when you attach that, kind of fold it forward. You have two sticky parts on either side. I'm going to do the same thing once again on a slightly smaller piece. I'm going to fold that in, that in half, just like this. And then what I'm going to do is, hopefully this should work, I'm going to stick this on either side of the egg here. And then hopefully the, uh, the sticky part will work all the way to the bottom just barely gonna make it, but I can always modify that. So make sure it's attached like that. And then what you're simply going to do is kind of make almost like a almost like a sumo wrestler kind of belt for this thing. So it's gonna wrap all the way around and go around to the back. And then you've got your little lip balm container right in the back here. And you can also make like a similar pocket for your pack of gum or whatever you use, like stuff like this as well. So there you have it. So like I said before, ideally whatever you use on a daily basis, you know, maybe outside school or in school, you can throw into the small organizer. You can always make it a lot longer if you, you want, you can actually make it the entire length of your, your locker door if you really wanted to, but that would be, you know, probably about three feet or more. So you can carry a lot of stuff in that if you really wanted to. To attach it to your locker, I have my magnets here. Once again, I'm gonna show you how to use the magnets. We're gonna flip the entire thing over, just like that. We're gonna take each one of these magnets. You can generally get magnets at any craft store. I typically get these at Joann's Fabrics. They seem to be like the only place in my area that stocks like the really powerful magnets. Like these are really powerful. I can barely get them off here. And what you do is just take one or two of these, stick them in each corner. I have, you know, at least four here. So I would take one in each corner. Make sure that the polarity, of course, is correct so that you can attach it to your locker. You might wanna take these in the school with you and then, you know, just, kind of attach them right there and then. So I got one in each corner, and that's going to be, you know, just how this attaches to the locker here. So I would just take a simple strip of duct tape and kind of stick those, you know, so that they stayed on to the back of the uh, strip here, or the sheet. Now I did say I would show you exactly how to attach it if you don't have magnets or if your locker isn't made of metal or, or anything like that. To do that, it's actually really simple. You're just gonna take a, a longer strip of tape, you know, put it on the top here, and then just physically stick this right to the back of your locker. And that should be okay, because it's not gonna leave like any sticky residue or anything like that. It should be pretty easy to take on and off if you really need to. And you, sometimes you can attach and reinforce the sides as well. So guys, hopefully you like this video on making a locker organizer. There's a million and one different ways to make this. It really totally depends on what you use in school. You know, certain things, you know, maybe required for certain classes. So you can, of course, you can always, you know, uh, stick all these different things in here. Of course, I showed you how to use, how to put the cosmetics and stuff you use on a daily basis. And you can just go crazy with this. Make it as large or as long as you want it to, as long as it fits in your locker. And you can go totally crazy with making a whole bunch of different designs. Any color can be used, you know, any color duct tape to really you know, mix and match the colors and customize as much as you like. So, hope you guys liked the video. I'll catch you next time on the channel for a few more tutorials coming this week and also next week as well. Catch you then.